guys. Hey guys, this is Draw88 here. Today we're gonna be uh, watching Rango. Now I'm filming this intro before watching Rango, and also sorry for that stutter. I heard a weird nose come from my phone. I never had my ringer on while recording, so. Anyways, uh, I'll be back when I have seen the movie. Goodbye. So, I just got done watching Rango. I don't know if I'm going to put clips of it in here. Probably not. So, this is one of my all-time favorite movies. I am going to, you know, talk about what was wrong in the movie. Like, continuity errors, you know, stuff like that. So, movie starts out with uh, him in this uh, glass cage, right? And he's uh, doing mouth exercises. And then a car hits a a uh, armadillo, and then uh, it the car bumps, and the car window is open. So Rango's cage goes flying it flying out, and so uh, he comes out and he talks to this the armadillo that gets hit, and uh, they're talking for a while, and then they he, he, the armadillo tells him to go west, so he does, and. While he while he's going west, he meets a toad, and it's blending in, and it tells him to blend in, but he doesn't do it in time. And uh, the hawk flies in, and so he's running away from the hawk, and then gets inside a bottle. The hawk picks up the bottle and starts flying up. Now this is where the first continuity error happens. He just ran away from the toad, right? So the hawk f flies up and drops the bottle. And it hits the toad. Are you telling me that he ran in a circle? Or are you telling me the toad followed him and then turned into a rock again? Because neither of those would make sense. So, yeah. He he uh, he runs away and he, the bottle gets split in half. The uh, toad gets eaten and then he walks to a sewer uh, exit exit and lays there and then he has a weird dream and then he wakes up to drowning almost drowning and then while he's trying to get the water well when it's uh drying up uh he grabs bean's foot now bean is really important in this story so bean takes him to dirt he goes in to dirt and he makes up this persona of rango and then this uh this um outlaw comes in with his group right they come in and rango i love this scene so basically rango does all this stuff to his face like so rango takes his cigar eats it gets a drink drinks it burps he lights and his burp lights the guy on fire then because he's on fire he gets a towel and starts trying to uh, smother the flames with it, but he's smacking him, right? And then he's like, oh wait, I got it. So he grabs the cactus bottle and he dumps it on his face. And it makes him blow up again. And then he, he's like, oh, I got it. And then he leaks his finger and then just douses out the last flame. All the while looking like he's actually doing it to make him mad. So that was a pretty good scene. But then they go into high noon. Give me a second. Hey guys, I'm John A88 here. So, sorry about that. I needed to go do something. Anyways, um, I love this movie. Where was I? Oh, right. So, he makes this guy, he's about to do a gunfight, right? They're about to go uh, head to toe going bang, 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 right? So, right before it happens, a hawk lands right behind Rango and scares off those guys. And Rango uh, doesn't see the hawk. He turns around after doing this whole speech and he sees the hawk. Then he starts running. Basically, they end up next to this water tower and he shoots uh, the gun to try and break the licorice that tied him to the thing, to the um, hawk. And so he shoots it. 
but it bounces off, hits a horseshoe hanging, and it hits the bird's beak, and it hits the um, rope connecting the water tower to the ground, and it makes the water tower freak out and fall on top of the bird, so he kills the bird. They all proclaim him the sheriff. Then he has to go to uh, see why his water got stolen, because everyone's freaking out about the water. Also, continuity error. So all the characters are designed to be West An like desert animals. I used to live in the desert, and I can guarantee for a fact there are not foxes in a desert. Especially red foxes. And there's a red fox in this movie. How does that make sense? So, uh, he, Rango's walking around when he's a sheriff, and then these mole, like, groundhogs, they show up, and they're like, hey, buddy, um, where's the bank? And when he's talking to them about, you have to prospect correctly, uh, the blind guy comes up, and he, he does, he's blind, like, his whole character is like he's blind. So, uh, he points them in the direction. Continuity error number three. This is how he goes. So he's like blind, right? Then he points this way without making any noise. And he turns this way, looks exactly at where he was pointing. How does that make sense? Excuse me, sir. Why? Why are you so stupid? Stop it. Stop that. Okay? Anyways. So this guy just has a ton of continuity errors. So basically, they steal the water, of course and they have to go get it back. But when they're going to get it back, the um, they find that the banker is, has been killed, right? And then they're on a cliff, right? Continuity error number four. So, all this time we've been told that Beans cannot control when she stops moving and she goes, and it makes a loud noise, so it tells you when it happens. But then she does it, right? And so he gives her a kiss on the cheek and then leaves. And then she just leaves without, like, uh, doing the, the other sound, which is normal. So you tell me she faked it. You told us that she couldn't control it. Again, how does it make sense? Yeah. So basically, they go to get the water back. Uh, they have to fight the... Uh, bats i'm not even going to touch the fact that they if you shoot them they explode into fireball when they crash into things like an actual jet i'm not even going to talk about how that does not make any sense but so everyone's talking about how he has to fight raw snake jake and so uh he realizes that there's orange stuff on the bottom of the mayor's boots and there was orange stuff at the scene of the crime right so he goes to talk to the uh, mayor and he takes him out golfing. Continuity error number f five at this point. So when the gunslinger ha th scene happened, they ran away, right? They're back. How? You never show us com them coming back. They're just there. And they're there for the rest of the movie too. So that I, to me that doesn't make sense. But... Honestly, if you like this movie, I'm not trying to crap on it. It's one of my favorite movies. The art style is really nice. They make everyone so gruff for an animated kids movie. Uh, they have a lot of references to um, uh, Western cult, like, you know, cowboys and all that culture. Uh, they also have a really good soundtrack. So I really like this uh, movie. But anyways, so he goes to get the water back, right? He, and he's freaking out at the mayor. And then he, um, uh, and then Ralph Snake Jake shows up and the mayor crosses on everyone and, uh, he gets sent away, right? He comes back. Uh, also there's a weird thing here that happens. I, I don't think it's a continuity error. It's more like poor animation, like poor setup, but Rango's crossing the road, right? To get to the other side and a car's coming and it zooms in on him and the car the car wheel would have hit him 
in the sh shot that he was in, but it zooms in on him, and the car wheel doesn't hit him. So that was just a little weird, in my opinion. I'm not going to count that as a continuity error, but anyways, yeah. And then he comes back after having an existential crisis, and then he's like, hey, you need to stop being so mean. And so uh, he ends up getting locked in the water tank and almost drowning again, but uh, Rattlesnake Jake gets turned on by the mayor, and then they all save the save the day, Rango does, because he had a bullet, and uh, Beans ate the bullet by accident, and then he gives, does the high remover, and she shoots it out of her mouth, and it hits a glass, and it breaks it. Now you're going to talk about how that does not work. Uh, then, uh, Ross Snake Jake catches the, the dude, and he's like, you're done, you're done. What I really like about the town, Dirtwater, is that it has, like, a barrel is an actual building. Then you also have mail as the post office. Like, it's a mailbox because they're supposed to be really small animals. And apparently this takes place in Washington because it shows a shot of Seattle. So, yeah. Also, last continuity error, when they're doing the, uh, at, at the very end, when he's thinking about everything, they're telling us that Seattle was built by a turtle in two days. I'm just gonna let that sink in. Anyways, if you like this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, like, comment, and we'll see you next time. <laughs> see you next time, huh? Goodbye.